Hello, uh, this is a follow-up video to the video I made pertaining to open as root in KDE Plasma's Dolphin File Manager. Um, today, uh, an issue popped up for me after I updated my system. Um, I'm now on KDE Plasma version 5.27.1. And what that issue um, is, and it's intermittent, it does not happen every time. But sometimes when I open up a directory as root, and I open up a file to edit it uh, with Kate, uh, what will happen is um, my display uh, scaling will revert back to 100%. Now my display scaling is set to 200% because I'm on 4K monitors. And, and so um, everything gets real small. Um, uh, and evidently what is happening is there's a display scaling set for the local user, but there's also a display scaling set for the root user, which defaults to 100%. Now, previously, up until today, um, every time I use my system, it just once I set the display scaling um, on my system, it would continually keep it at 200%. I'll, I'll, I'll show you. Um, so right here, I have this display global scale set to 200% because my monitors are 4K monitors. Um, but so what was, what was happening is that um, it, would, it would change its display scaling back to 100%, which evidently was the default for root. That's what happened, started happening today. But even though I'd open up, um, I'd open up the um, display settings here, it would still show as 200%. And I would have to go back and change it to some other value, apply it, then change it back to 200% and hit apply to get my display scaling back. Um, so I've opened up a bug report with um, the Plasma development team and one of the uh, developers was kind enough to suggest that I uninstall open as root and instead install KIO-admin and that solved my issue. So uh, I'll show you how to do that uh, here. If you're an experienced Linux user, then that's all you need to do. Uninstall Dolphin as, Open Dolphin as root if you have already installed it, and then install KIO-admin. But for those who are not experienced, I'll go through uh, the settings. So let's first open up the Dolphin File Manager. To uninstall Open as root, we'll go here if you've already installed it. Configure, Configure Dolphin, Context Menu, Download New Services, Type in open as root and uninstall. So it is now uninstalled. Click OK. Now to install it, um, it's simple. Just go, uh, let me actually enlarge my on here. Sudo apt install KIO hyphen admin okay um, now if you want to would instead rather use the um, discover open up discover and let me pull it back over here Okay, just type in KO admin, and it's right here, and you can just install it from there. Now, with KIO admin installed, um, if we go here, instead of open as root, it just says open as administrator. Click on that, enter your password, and now. Um, now you can edit the uh, the files as root. So we'll go back to etc. Uh, let's go back to uh, default. Let's go back to grub. It'll prompt for a password again. But I'm able to, you know, make changes to the file and save it. So basically it's the same functionality. Uh, but with KIO admin, I have not been uh, getting the issue the di display scaling issue. Now, if you're on a 1080p monitor um, and you are um, just leaving your scale at 100%, that issue should not affect you. So you could probably continue using the plugin. Um, 
or you can, you know, you can go to KIO hyphen admin, the developer that had responded to my, um, bug report had strongly recommended that I uninstall open as root and switch to KIO admin, which is what I've done. Now that issue did not affect me on my arch, um, uh, installation. I'm not sure why, because I also updated that today, but perhaps the, um, the arch repository doesn't have the latest KDE updates yet. Uh, Neon is usually the first distribution to get them, so it may not yet be impacted by it, but it may be here shortly, maybe within the next week, I would guess. Um, now, the other issue I had with Arch is that it was uh, KIO admin was not in the official repository, so I uh, had to install it uh, via the Arch user repository. I have Yay installed, so I just installed it via Yay. So basically, I'm preemptively preventing that issue from happening. So um, if you have OpenAS root installed, if you have that plugin installed, uh, you may want to unplug it and uh, or uninstall it and instead install um, the KIO admin file or package. Um, and if you don't have OpenAS root installed, but you want to have that functionality in Dolphin, the Dolphin File Manager, um, then I would recommend installing KIO admin instead of the Open as Root plugin. Um, now, for those don't, that don't know, what with the Open as Root functionality or Open as Admin ad, as admin, um, actually, let me go back down here too. So you see here it's now called Open as Administrator. What that functionality gives you the ability to do is go into um, um, the files that are owned by root and and directories and edit those files and directories if you're making changes or troubleshooting or um, customizing your installation um, but as, as always you know please be very careful when doing that because you can completely bork your system um, you may want to run time shift uh, before messing around with any of the root files so if you accidentally bork something you can uh, restore your installation via time shift. Uh, I have time shift r runs every day. It, it does a new backup, so if I mess anything up, I can just install it to the previous day. Um, actually, there's the time shift files there. So, anyways, I just wanted to um, make this video because I have a video um, directed to Open as Root in which a lot of people have watched and a uh, number of people have installed Open as, the Open as Root plugin and have found it very useful. Um, but again, this issue, it popped up t t uh, today with uh, in Neon, um, although it has not yet popped up in Arch yet, but I suspect it will. So um, switching over to KIO Admin will um, hopefully prevent any future issues from occurring. Thank you for watching the video and have a great day. Bye.